From day one, the juice told me his focus, his light at the end of the tunnel was paroling. As you heard moments ago on 2020, OJ Simpson's parole hearing next week will be a major national news story. 13 Action News reporter Brian Callahan is live outside Palace Station with a look at what life is like for Simpson behind bars and why he's not happy about the new media attention. Brian. Yes, Steve, people at home heard 2020 delving deeper into what led up to that fateful night in the room here at Palace Station, but the network giving us extra footage from their interview with the retired guard at the Lovelock Correctional Center who talked about Simpson's life behind bars. In the 20 years I worked at the Lovelock Correctional Center, he has got to be the happiest guy, the most positive inmate I've ever met. Jeffrey Felix is a retired guard who became friends with OJ Simpson while the former NFL star was behind bars for the botched 2007 robbery at the Palace Station. Simpson saying he was trying to get personal memorabilia back. I thought I was confronting friends and retrieving my property. I didn't mean to steal anything from anybody. Felix says behind bars, Simpson is a leader heading up the prison softball league and exercising to make sure he's able to walk out of prison if he's granted parole. He's got his own uh, entourage of people he hangs out with. Uh, officers say good morning to him. Everybody talks to OJ and OJ talks to everybody. The retired guard says there's no question Simpson gets special treatment in prison. He'll go to the front of the clinic line, the front of the canteen line, the front of the culinary line. Everybody knows this. But one area Simpson is not getting his way is coverage of his upcoming parole hearing. Felix says Simpson would prefer a low-key process like he had four years ago when he earned a partial parole. Not had any incidences despite all the stories and the tabloids and everything. Felix says Simpson feels the added attention could influence the decision of the six members of the parole board who will decide if he walks out of prison this year. OJ is not happy about it. He thinks any kind of media coverage could be damaging to his parole hearing. Of course, Simpson will have a chance to address that parole board on his at his hearing on Thursday. We're planning to send a crew up there to Carson City for that hearing to keep you updated on air and on KTNV.com. Reporting live, Brian Callahan, 13 Action News. Brian, thank you.